if I add an effect, go to uh, video effects, and uh, let's try and see if we can add in a film grain. Yeah. Okay. We click on it and we drag it over to the video file. Okay, and it will, as you can notice, it straight away it applies the effect, and you also get a setting up here where you can change it to add more effects, add less effect, you know. And same with the uh, the granularity, and also the same with this one. So you can mess around with all these effects. Now, if you apply an effect, which we have here, as you can see, and you're not quite happy with it, okay, you just go up to media effects and you'll notice that there's another one up here as well, you see. Basically these are all here are the same ones that are down here. So there are more than one ways to do 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 something, you know. So it's not a problem at all. However if you've applied an effect that you don't think looks very good, you can just click on this button here, event effects, and you'll notice that this is here, this is ticked. So if you want to untick that, it goes back to normal again and you no longer have this effect in your video. But you can add more than one effect, so you're not st um, stuck with just one effect, you can add as many effects as you want. So it's really, really quite fun to mess around with this, and it's a very, very useful video editing program as well. So now we've got all our videos um, and our sound sorted out, um, there's more than one thing that you can do with this program. So if I just delete this, get this out of here, move this forward. Okay, now say for instance, uh, you know, you don't like um, this bit here, this scene's not good enough, you don't want that. You can just drag it down here and it and it finishes there. And if you want it a few seconds after this clip, so you know, you want it up to this point here, you can click on it, hold Control and C to copy it, move the scrubber to the end, Control and V, and you will get a copy of that. So, as you notice, it's exactly the same as this. But if you don't want the uh, the second after this scene here, um, what you can do is change that. So you can you know, scrub this along, open this bit forward further, and basically you'll miss out that little bit of scene that you didn't want. So you see, so rather than importing the whole video again, you know you, you can just um, you know copy certain segments of the video. Uh, you can just basically. Uh, cut a bit out, add a bit in, so it's really really quite user friendly and quite easy to do.